It's just a beef jerky. It is beef jerky. And super delicious. Hi everyone, this is Nai Chan again. Hello, my boom with Tao Chan. I said, Nai Chan. Today I have a new recipe for you guys to follow. My husband love, just love beef jerkies. So every time when we go out, we always bring jerkies with us. If we go fishing, if we go hiking, just wherever is beef jerky coming so convenient. So today I will show you guys how I make my beef jerky. And here I have, I bought this piece of meat from Costco. It's about $43. So um, my husband would like something with more fibery, like more tendons in it, but I don't. So it's round top part. So you can use any part you want. A lot of people would love to use the briskets, but brisket is a little bit too fattening for me. So I like this one. So I want to show you guys how I make it. Um, so guy or. เอ่อเดี๋ยวว่าอีบัวมิงจาวนะอีบัวมิงฟาวจองฟาลมนี่เดี๋ยวบิงบัดเบียวนี่มีอย่างเจ้านี้อีบัวคุณต่อออกายท
personal preference. Now they wait and see and see him or a giant yin jiang gong na yi long na fun fun zao sa jen zao and sa jen na i wait and see him he sa jen na fan jiu buan han te nam jiang la an si zui ha so this is not spicy this is just for the color and then you will need oil i would say about maybe a quarter cup and then you marinate this and then you kept it in your, your fridge overnight and then tomorrow you can dry air dry outside or you can use your oven to kind of like slowly dry it up and then after you dry it up then you can fry it Now my lap and my uncle my to yen ji mo ni ya hoi na bo to ta an ji da wo oven so you see see when the wa guy ti tian hang a ti ta li la de wa so we see guy cow go down go oil na we start to see na oh oh I forgot black pepper where are my black pepper yeah black pepper I forgot lots of this black pepper okay. Oh, I want to put some of my homemade chili oil. This is optional, okay, guys? You, you don't, you can't eat spicy, you don't need to put this one. And I like it because it gives a very aromatic smell. Nyom tang. Nyom tang long te o. Nyom mong bue pia mue zop zhe ning. Han bue nyom long na mue pia zop zhe na te ma dun pa yo. Zha zha ko ma dun pa yo. My dog too off. So when you're mixing it, make sure you mix it well to incorporate all the spice into the meat. Otherwise you don't have, otherwise you have some pieces very flavorful and some pieces have no flavor at all. So make sure you massage it well. This is how it's supposed to look like for now. So I will keep this in the fridge. Till tomorrow. If you have a small space in your fridge, uh, if you have small space in your fridge, try to put everything in there like that and keep it in there. So that way it doesn't take up too much space. So ta hana ta ti tu yen ja hoi a ja hoi wo de wa lu dao chan fai la an chan ne tu ye ta fan overnight me ma ta ten ti yen overnight le ja hoi ma ta ta kang ga o kang ga tu pu ye tu ya so you gonna keep this in the fridge to marinate till tomorrow morning or to tomorrow afternoon or whenever you have time to do it but do not keep it too long because if too long it gives you different flavor so after that you can air dry them or you can do uh, like on a low heat on our oven and bake it for uh it's to completely dry up then after that you can deep fry it okay let's see you guys tomorrow okay this is how it looks like after three hours of on 200 bake in the oven it's still kind of wet, so then I will air fry them until it looks like this one.
I bake for three hours on 200 and then I air fry for 10 minutes on 300. Look, it's all done. I air fry them and it looks like this right now. Look, look just a bit jerky. It is a bit jerky. And super delicious. Mmm. That's so good. This one is a little darker because it was it's cold.